it's really all about the quality of product, and that's a big reason why we do local. Now, Friends Specialty at the Garden Cafe has partnered with local farmers to get fresh-grown produce. 27 First News reporter Christina Mullins stopped by the restaurant inside Fellows Riverside Gardens. She found out the partnership isn't only about giving guests some tasty meals, it's bringing jobs to the, family, to the valley and keeping our money local. Iron Roots, we've got our lettuce for the day. Once a week, local farmers deliver freshly grown produce to Friends Specialty at the Garden Cafe. You're supporting your local farms, which keeps it beautiful around your city. Uh, you're supporting your local people, and you have a better uh, product. And with a better product comes a better flavor. We harvest our stuff first thing in the morning, and Mitch gets it that afternoon. So the taste is just, you can't even compare it to something in the grocery store. From lettuce to mushrooms, it's all grown here in the valley. We have some fresh carrots here that we're just going to chop the heads off, and we're going to use these for our salad, salads. As of now, the cafe teams up with 10 local farmers, like Iron Roots, White House Fruit Farms, and Zany Pearl. Our list grows as the produce grows. So on our menu, in the bottom here, we have a list of the farmers. Since most of the ingredients here at Friends Specialty at the Garden Cafe comes from local farmers, the menu is always changing. The biggest ingredient this time of year strawberries. As the berries are coming in the season, what you try to do is pair them with something that they really do well with. Using locally grown produce is not only helping to support farmers, but keeping money here in the valley. You know, the value of your dollar when you come into a local business just goes so much farther. The turkey panini, with the food, I mean, with the chicken salad. It's also about employing people. We have about 15 employees. Keeping jobs, money, and food local is what the Garden Cafe is all about. In Youngstown, Christina Mullen, WKBN 27 First News.